Hey guys, it's Richard here, and I am bringing you Roller Coaster Tycoon 3 Platinum. Now, I'm super excited to be doing this uh, playthrough for you guys. Um, I imagine this to be spectacular, and it's going to be amazing, and I can't wait to share it with you guys. Um, a few things, I have no editing software as of right now, so I'm unable to edit any of this footage. It's all raw, it's all here for you. Um, as you can see at the very top, it's barely cut off. It's because this, um, the screen capture device I'm using, it couldn't, um, it couldn't spread throughout the entire thing, and I need to show the bottom of the screen for you guys as well. So, that little part's cut off. Um, yeah, so anyway, uh, we have a huge land to work with. Oh my goodness. Stretching out all off on the left side, up here, to the right, and back again. Amazing. Alright, anyway. Um, my layout for this is that I'm gonna... I need, I need some sort of transportation because, as you can imagine, these little peeps walking around this whole park, it's ridiculous. It would take a ridiculous amount of time. So I'm going to build a transportation uh, thing. It's probably going to be a monorail or something near the front here. It's going to spread out all um, around in some shape, kind of like a circle, but not entirely because I want to add some depth to it as well. So we're going to do that. Um, <clears throat> but obviously I need certain parts of it to actually happen first before I can actually build a monorail that goes around the entire park. So near the front here, it's going to be more generic. It's going to be more like what you see at a th typical theme park. So we have some um, generic, uh, generic items that we can uh, use for this. And I'm just going to delete all of these so that I know what I can use. Um, and we're going to start right away. We're going to work with this path here. Just going to, um, here. I prefer doing like a three-fold path. So three, like, uh, three lines. So I'm going to do that right now. Just so that there's more room for people to walk. And I'm going to be able to use this later to my advantage. So we're going to do that right now. <clears throat> and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take out some spots in the middle one two uh, it's all mathematical like you if, if you've never played roller coaster tycoon before you want it to look as great as possible so I'm trying to do that right now for you guys uh, yeah so I have that I'm gonna be putting uh, plants and stuff in the middle so I'm gonna show you right now here is the foliage so you can use whatever you want I am gonna use a large holly I think that looks pretty good yeah actually I'm gonna alternate it so we're gonna have holly holly and then different color we're gonna try medium apple tree yeah that looks good um, now scenery and foliage make or break a theme park um, I mean, you could have rides and stuff, and it would it would be great. But I mean, you really need to decorate your theme park and make it look nice, or else it's it's just a typical theme park, and it's nothing special. Like I'm I'm sorry, but it's true. I don't know. But even before, like I would play Roller Coaster Tycoon two, and my like how I design my theme park, it it would just be pretty much generic. So. I want to make this as special and grand. Um, so we're gonna do that, okay? And I'm so excited to do this. All right, anyway, it looks pretty great so far anyway. Uh, with the small hedges that I put around there, I think it looks dandy. Uh, but there's still nothing. <laughs> as you can see, there's still nothing here. So my plan of attack is I'm gonna have some kind of like food court near the front of the entrance because you know people are oops I didn't want that there people are gonna want to eat right and I don't want my peeps to start actually we're gonna use a different type of path here um, hold on it takes a lot of practice um, anyway what kind of path do I want we're gonna do we're gonna do some crazy paving here so yeah we're gonna use that that seems like a typical like food court kind of path 
so I'm gonna be designing a small building like thing here um, it's not gonna be too crazy so we're gonna do this right now we're getting that the brick wall um, what I want is the full height brick wall face <clears throat> oops that's not what I wanted come on full height brick wall face this one yep there we go Okay, so we're gonna stretch it out quite a bit. Hold on, let me zoom in here. Uh, I don't know how big I want it to be. We're gonna six, seven, eight. We're gonna do ten, nine. Oops, 10. Okay, turn it over. One, two. I think five works there, and then five more here. <clears throat> Maybe I do six. Might do six. Yeah, I think six works better. So add one more here. Perfect. All right, now uh, let's continue this path. <clears throat> so we're using the crazy paving. Go into it, and then we're gonna. Oh no, that's not what I want to do. Delete that. Okay, so we're gonna go around this bad boy, like so. Oh, I'm just hoping this works out. Okay, I want that. Yeah, that looks pretty symmetrical to me. I think that works. Um, I'm just gonna test this right now and see if the stalls fit inside the space I provided. Oh no, it doesn't fit. Uh, what do I want to do here? Oh no. Um, let's turn it. Okay, maybe I'll have them on the inside then. What I wanted was on the outside so that people could... I think the inside works too. So we're going to do that. We're going to put the food... We're going to put the food stalls right here up at the front. Um, okay, just going to customize it. So for the burger, the, for the burger place, you can add pickles and cheese. I'm uh, going to do that. And then what I love about this this version of the Roller Coaster Tycoon series is that you can synchronize all the stalls of this type so that you don't have to continuously press what you want uh, every time you buy a new stall. So we're gonna do, yeah, so let's see, burgers and fries. Yeah, you would think that they would sell fries at a burger place, but obviously they decided not to do that here and separate both of them. So just doing those quickly. Um, yeah, okay. Um, I'm just gonna add the stalls and then um, I'm gonna cut out a little bit of all this like tedious work so you guys don't have to watch me do it all the time. So, and let's do cotton candy, yes, because who doesn't want cotton candy here? Who doesn't? I certainly wouldn't. Anyway, okay, yeah, that looks pretty good. Um, I think either side I'm gonna want. Um, Drinks. Yep. I only have four drinks so far, so we're gonna add coffee. Ugh, love coffee. So much. And hot cocoa. Because those those seem like they'd fit together, right? Coffee and cocoa. Oops. Turn that around properly. Okay. And then on this side <coughs> Lemonade and drinks and actual pop. So the pop and drinks and the uh, sorry lemonade. <laughs> Perfect. Okay. And now um, I'm gonna I'm gonna design this with all foliage like outside of this video because I want to be able to provide you guys with enough uh, footage that it's not me uh, editing and doing boring stuff because that's that's just pretty boring. 
So yeah, there's my building. Um, I think I'm just gonna leave it as it is. I might want to add a roof later on, but for now I'm gonna leave it like that. Now we're gonna build some rides because we need it. We need more. Some we need some rides here. Uh, what I want to do. Uh, let me just see here. Since we're going with the whole generic idea at the front, I'm gonna build a merry-go-round because it's iconic. The merry-go-round is an iconic ride, and you need everyone needs one of these in their uh, in their park. So. I think I'm going to add it near the front. <clears throat> and then right after the merry-go-round, we're going to do we're going to build a monorail and which is going to stretch out throughout the park. And I'm going to work on that design later on in another video. Right now we're going to build a queue line so like so. Um let's see. We're going to do it till here and then the path for the exit. Uh, do I want to use this? Yeah, I think I think we'll use the dirty paving as like the path for the generic uh, place, and we're gonna do it like that. I think. Uh, let me just think about this. Um, yeah, we're gonna connect it. So, hold on, I'm just gonna build a few more of these. Uh, Asphalt. There's asphalt paths right here. Yep, perfect. Um, I'm gonna take away these two, and I think what I'm gonna do is stretch it around like this. That way we can um, decorate the inside of this uh, of this little uh, path here. Uh, yeah, we're gonna do that. Uh, yeah, I think that works. I think that works fine. One more path there. Stretch this out. Oh, can I can I can I not stretch it out? There you go. There, that looks good. Oh, whoops, forgot that part. Okay, cool. Um, so yeah, we have our merry-go-round, and I'm going to do some little decorating here. So what do I have here? Um, that's not what I want. I want this one. Medium oak trees, yes. Okay, what else do we have to work with? Um, hmm, small oak. I think that looks lovely, yeah. That works too. Now, instead of just adding all just trees, we're going to add a little bit more depth into this. So we're going to do this, and we're going to... Oh, no, that's not what I want. Oh, I can add a water cannon. We're gonna add this. I think you need water in order to do that, so forget that. Um, what do I want? Okay, here we go. <clears throat> Dolphin fountain. I think that looks. I think that works. Dolphin fountain right up here. Add another one here. I think that works fine. A dolphin pound, you know, splashing. Um, what else works with this? I'm about to end the video very soon. Um, because it's Christmas time, I'm gonna add a lot of candy canes throughout this uh, throughout this theme park because you know it's 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 that time of the year, and it's most fitting to have a. So that's not what I want. That's not where I want it. Up here, up here, up here. I think that works fine. Okay, now before I end the video, I'm going to put this on test drive and I'm gonna ride it for you guys. Here we go. Yeah, merry go round. Woo! You can change here at the bottom. You can change the. Uh, the camera in which you want it. Sweet. Okay, I'm gonna add music to this really quick. Let's do Bush Baby. That sounds pretty good. Alright, anyway guys, here's my theme park so far. It's really small, but I think I made a lot of progress uh, talking about this video to you guys and what I plan on doing. So in the next video, I'm gonna be expanding this part and we're gonna start the foundation of our monorail. 
Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. I'll be back with another video very soon for this. Peace, guys.